Babalik po kami dito sa PVL Open Conference. Nakuha nga ng ating Petrogas Angels ang set number 1, 25 to 17. And looking at the Angels' performance, sila yung naka-cruise control na kalmado-kalmado, walang ginagawang anything crazy yet. Pero sa panik naman ng ating Pokaisan Air Force Lady Warriors, quite a uh, disheartening performance if you're a Lady Warrior fan. Yeah, you're right. I mean, to lose 17 to 25, I mean, kind of unheard of. Only because we, we saw the way they played in the first set. We've seen that their past game, we know what they can do. But here in the first set, clearly, they're, you know, step late. They're second late, they're split second late. So we're hoping, you, we talked about them being a diesel team, yeah. So they're hoping here in the second set, they're going to actually step on the gas now because you don't want to be down two sets to zero. But for, for the Angels, Sabi mo nga, cruise control, they're playing very well, I guess, following the game plan. And it, when you look at the, the numbers, attacks is even. Blocking the Angels by two, served by one. But it's the opponent's errors. We're talking about the performance again of the Lady Warriors. Yun yung, you know, yun yung kulang eh. They're not too into the game, committing, you know, errors that are uncharacteristic of them. So they're hoping again, a better set here in the second game. At yun nga yung pumatay dito sa ating Kukaiswan Air Force Lady Warriors. Which is weird kasi, remember, this is also a champion team here in this league. And we're looking at a very new and freshly minted squad naman on the other side of the court. So let's see if the Angels will continue to outfly the Air Force yeah. in this That's true. set. That's true. And we, we gotta give it also to Chi Sai. Play very well for the Angels. Uh, it's sure yung defense then, no? not too much running for, for Chisai. That's what you want. Just like that last play, she went to the Leon. Sa kabilang panic naman, Yong Kong sasagot. Tempiatura inangat dito para kay Pablo. Pablo, wide from the net. Shen chooses Sabete. Over-receive. Saet goes to Balwalwa at yun ang pupuntos para dito sa ating Angels. Puntahan natin ang report ni Vince Velasco. Noreen and Sinjin, did you know that Baneng Mercado's first sport was actually tennis? That's right, but after a brief stint of playing tennis, sabi niya napakaloni daw ang tennis because you're the only one on the court. Which led her to playing volleyball. Sabi niya ang first experience niya volleyball was playing on the street with one of her childhood friends. At one point, she had to ask her mom to buy a net. They tied it to their gate and to another tree. Pero sabi nga nila, they had to keep stopping the game because cars were passing and they couldn't pass with the net in the way. She also said now she can't imagine her life without volleyball and her top favorite things about the sport are her teammates, the support of the crowd, and eating all you can after every game. Back to you guys. After every game, eating all you can. That sounds really good, Vince. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Yun nga din eh. Pareho, pareho tayo ng unang reaction to them. Tennis talaga <laughs> sa lahat ng naging sports. Iba lang na unang track and field. Of course, we're talking about Panang Mercado. But speaking of that story from Vince, no, I'm wondering kung nandun pa kaya yung net sa gate. Sa harap ng gate nila. Wala na. na nasira na ng truck nga. <laughs> na, na sagasaan na. Nasagasaan na. Pero ito, balik tayo dito. Sasagot si Pablo para sa Pukaisan Air Force Lady Warriors. At yun ang magbibigay ng kanilang unang puntos. Great slow mode. So, I showed how she can beat. Kamukha na nga ng logo ng PVL yung pagtalot ni Maile. Pero ito, she gets a service error from the service line. Abante ng tatlong puntos dito ang ating Angels, Balwalwa. Formerly a Lady Warrior, now on the service line. Well, it's what we said, the characteristic error. The service error of Pablo. Yeah. It didn't even... It, it's even at the uh, right side of the right antenna. <laughs> That's how weird that serve was. Maybe there's something with the, the Pong Shui, the, <laughs> the Mojo, the, the Juju, some people will say. But let's see if... Kaya ba nilang bawin yan dahil Yonko scored off the block there on the last point. Lead is down to two. Uh, and we have a tweet here coming from Juliana Miguela watching and supporting the Bukai Sweat Air Force Lady Warriors all the way from General Luna Quezon. Go, go, Bagyong Pablo. Pero mukhang 
Mahina pa signal number one pa lang ngayon si Myla. Tingnan natin, lalakas at lalakas yan. Siyempre, naabang na natin. Sa kabilang panig naman, ito, nagsicheer si Lopez. Zhukeng, sabi niya, Go Petrogas, go Ate Paneng. Watching all the way from Obando, Bulacan. So, fans from both sides of the court, talagang gising na gising handang handa. Abangan natin, siyempre, dyan yung mga international na mga kapamilya natin na kapit sa atin. Running play coming from Lunag, and that soft touch gives an easy point by Dito sa ating gas angels. Yeah, that's what you want. I mean, Lunag doesn't get a whole lot of sets, but whenever they get, they go to her, she'll score the points. They are the unsung heroes kasi ng And freebies pa nga, ika nga natin. But there again, service is on point by sa panic ng ating Petrogas Angels, John Sabete, getting an ace there. That's uh, like a, a mental lapse from Casita. She wants to look at the ball. Nakaka apat na excellent things oh, itong si Jonah. Pero yun, libreng puntos naman binigay niya dito para sa ating Lady Warriors. Coach Jerry with the familiar um, face yeah. that we see from Coach Jerry. Saed chooses Mercado. She's checked there. Mercado on the second try with some hesitation. Semana chooses Casilag. Easy pick up there for Sabete. Balwalwa mula sa back row. Tapik mula kay Del Palomata ang magtatapos. At magbababa sa isang putos ng abate ng ating Metrogas. Yeah, that's a better rally for, for this match, actually. Both teams match are being aggressive in terms of defense. So we're hoping that, uh, you know, we'll pick up the pace of the game. Let's see if that service ace would be helpful for here at our Air Force Lady Warriors. We're going to play at six points. And that's a really good point. That was the best quality rally that we've had so far. Yeah, in this match. Yeah, so let's see if if the quality is starting to go up kasi mukhang ginaganahan na yung ating Mukhae Sweat Air Force Lady Warriors. Yep, and, and for the Angels naman, they're having problems with their first ball. That's two, uh, two, two, you know, subpar receptions there. Kasi mukhang ngayon sumasagot na sila. They're answering back to the challenge that the Angels had yeah. in the first set. So, let's see how the Angels will answer back to that naman. But here, Overcooked was the hit of Kasilag. We're tied at seven points. So, palita ng punto so far. That's true. And, you know, for for Perkari, that's what you don't want to see. Eh? You know, these errors, they committed nine unforced errors in the first set. You don't want to see that. Especially, you want to get, you want to build your own momentum here in the second set. Let's see, because they seemingly have more energy now. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good side by the Sasaki Pokaris with Air Force. A dumb ball coming from Wendy and Seman, and that brings them to the first technical timeout. But Babalik po kami dito. And we are back here in the Phil Oil Flying V Center. Kasama natin si DJ Louie, always bringing the throwback hits and the chill sounds. <laughs> But it looks like we hyped up the crowd. Of the Angels are down by one. But if you just joined us here today, set number one is on the side of our Petrogas Angels with a seven-point advantage. But here at set number two, it seems like Mokai is up for the challenge and is ready to fight back. So let's see if we can continue to fight. We're going to be using our Mokai Sweat Air Force Lady Warriors. Yeah, but they've been targeting Sabete actually in the past, you know, the two services, tapos pati yung sa reception niya, and so far so good for them, so I, would, I wouldn't be surprised if they continue to target Sabete. But they're on the last play. Nagugulat ka nung si Jesse Teleon on that quick play. Yeah, we all know Jesse, you know, very, very agile, eh? very light. The speed eh? talaga. Oh. Yung talaga yung pag quick hit, kayang-kaya ni Jesse. Tempo zero. Or zero tempo rather. But on the other side, Pablo will try to answer. Pablo, off the block. Easy point. Fire sa Pakai Sweat Air Force. That's a classic fire na Pablo for you. Off the hands of the blocker. Lalapag lang right behind the block. 
the power is still there. Pag yung ano? Now, the teammate naman niya, Del Palomata, will try to score from the service line. But De Leon will try to end that. Leon that works again. Mukhang papaganahin ni Chisa. At ngayon, ang kanyang mga gitna. Yeah. yeah. You know, we did see that in the first set, and they won. So, nakita niya. That's just how good a, a setter also Chisa it is. Nakita niya na here in the second set. Medyo, sabi mo nga, lumalaban na itong Lady Warriors. Hey, you know, let's change it up a bit. <laughs> Four touches, ang itatawag doon against our Small gas, in, or better gas angels rather. And serving nine. And sayang, bitin yung mga angat eh. Oh my. And then A for effort ah. <laughs> yes, definitely. And if you're the coach, you'd really appreciate that. When the Antimana now on the service line, Sayed puts it up. Sabete, cross court! Wow! wow. Cross court shot. Mukhang may gigil itong si Sabete ngayon. I remember the one of the first few games no, that she played, that kind of the, the conference. So we covered it. And we were talking about her because it's a new name. For yes. Control. And she's shown us really what she can do. She deserves to be playing alongside you know, names like Pablo and Mercado. And she proves that she is formidable in really the, the serving of that spot in the first six yeah. of Coach Jerry. Yeah. <laughs> Parang bago pangalan, hindi mo yung next week sa nanggaling yun. Exactly. Pero ang ganda kagad ng pinapakita ang fire dito sa Petrogas Angels. But ito, surprising digits. Uh, Myla Pablo with just four attack points here in the past two sets. So let's see if that will still grow for Myla. But on the other side of the court, miscommunication. Or rather, mistiming ata. Uh, uh, miscue na rin kasi, you know, we know that uh, they practice that. Yung mga quick and... Service. Timing is uh, obviously off there. And Chisa is now put into the corner to really do some magnificent plays here. So I think we're going to start seeing a lot of plays. Uh, on cue. <laughs> There's one. 11 to 12. Because before, it's just a pure game. Simple. A quick. A quattro. Now, we're noticing shuffling between the spikers on the side of our Metro Gas Angels as well. Na bored na siya. Eh. No first, no first set, parang very basic na eh. No? Na bored. <laughs> but the challenge is up there because you have Wendy Antiman on the other side of the court. Oh, yeah. But Sabete now drops it in. Nice save there from Tempiatura. Bibo lang binigay ni Pablo. Inangat dito para kay Sabete ulit. Good cover. Tempiatura puts it up for Yako. She's denied. Kasilag hits the Kasilag line there. The spot. 11, 13. Crappy play, but uh, the Lady Warriors get the point still. Naging running eh, no? <laughs> no miss time eh, naging running eh, but uh, she'll take it. That still works, the hell. Pinagulong yung ball eh. Yeah. Pangs Panaga, ooh. I was just about to say, Pangs Panaga is one of the tougher servers. She is! So again, yung errors ni the Lady Warriors, that's what's actually breaking their own momentum. Something that you won't expect here from Pukai Sweat. It's a one-point game. Sabete on the service line. Palomata, a single block there by Cherry Luna. We're tied at 13. It's a good matchup actually, you know, Palomata and Luna. It's a good reaction. The unsatisfied pa din from that block. <laughs> Marami pang papaloon dito, but Kasilag. That ball doesn't cross para kay Ellie. More touches. Butos, More change of game for at Butos para sa ating Petrogas Angels. Habate sila ng isang Butos. At ipapasok naman Gases. yun si Joy Gases para kay Ellie Kasilag. Yeah, I mean, you know, for the fans of the Lady Warriors, Joy Cassis has always been, a, you know, a starter uh, when they're still playing for purely Air Force. So, parang it's a good, good addition now here. He does a second set for Coach Jasper Jimenez. A little too wide. Fifteen. Very deep. Pa din yun na babago yung Bojo sa loob ng court. Butos ulit ay mapupunta para dito sa ating Petrogas Angels. Abante sila ng dalawang butos. Which is weird so, dahil kanina it was really the Lady Warriors were up and ahead. Cases checked and 
gets a point off the block. Yeah, that's one hugot that, that you like, you know, from the bench that they score. It's actually very hard because it's air gone, it's cold. So, yung normally, it's going to warm up. Warm up. Yeah. Pero mukhang namang sinasabihang mag-warm up at naka-jacket naman yung mga girls natin. <laughs> Kasis ulit on the second try. Kasis denies Sahin on the joust and she ties the match at 15. Yeah, Mercado put it too near the net. Sahin was forced, you can see that Sahin was forced to, to joust. And must square uh, si Kasis eh, that joust. So better there for the pickup. They go to Nunag. Sasagot sa kabilang panig, Palomata. Lucky hit there for Del Palomata. And that brings our Pukaiso and Air Force Lady Warriors to the second technical timeout. Magbabalik po kong ito sa PBL Open Conference. And we are back here on the Premier Volleyball League Open Conference. We're seeing the fans of our cool smashers getting ready at handang handayan sa komporta para kinaalay sa Valdez dahil susunod na yung match nila against the Tacloban Fighting Warriors depending on what happens oh. in the match that we have here on hand. You're still watching with me, Sinjin Reyes and Nareen Go, and this is the matchup between our Pukai Sweat Air Force Lady Warriors and the Petrogas Angels. Our fans here, mukhang galing pasok pa yung mga batang yun ah. Yan, it's a weekday. But you know, we gotta mention, Sinj, no, na the importance of this game is when we talked about the, the standings earlier, the four and this is a match between number four, four and number, number five, five yes. you know? So the Angels are number four and the Lady Warriors are number five. So they're looking at yung goal nila is to get into the final four. So each win is very important for both of them. So this game is really crucial. For the, if they want to get into that. Yes, it, it is a very crucial game. But the only difference, though, is looking at our angels, they still have six more games to go. Okay. Sa Air Force naman, kung titignan natin, sila naman, mayroon pa silang limang games na lamang. So, kasi late nga nagsimula ng second round itong ating angels. So, yun yung medyo delikado. Kasi, kumbaga, marami pang bigas na kakainin oh, ng angels true. para makapasok or ma-maintain yung number 4 spot nila. But there's a ball touch. Yep. Ball but, well, they gotta start the day. And they really have to because it seems like our Pukaiswet Air Force are ready to fight here. Yeah, I mean, I mean they, they lost the first set. You don't want to be down two, two sets. sets. Yeah. But we've seen it. Pukaiswet game, down two sets. Umabol. Fairness. Again, Screamline, umabol sila ng two more sets to force a fifth and decider. So, not impossible for Mokai Sweat. But this time, this second set is has a quite slow pace. Pero mukhang palita talaga ng puntos ang pinapakita nitong dalawang kumbunan natin. As Saed serves, Kases there for the pickup. They go to Palomata on the play. Sasagot sa kabila, Balwalwa. Over-receive. They choose Balwalwa again. Soft touch. Ooh! Balwalwa. No coverage. Sa panic ng ating Kamais with Air Force. That's a smart tip. Just really, you know, that's what makes a good player. Yeah. Okay, you read your opponent's defense. And it's like, yeah, big hole there. Easy point tuloy for uh, Balwalwa. And it's funny because it has been consistent for our Bukais with Air Force. That problem. Yeah, with the one right behind play. the blockers area. Yeah. Walang oh. nagko-cover doon. Pero ito, sinasabing may mata sa <laughs> likod ng kanyang mga ng kanyang buhok or sa likod ng kanyang ulo. Is si Wendy and Semana with a classic yep. drop play. The answer's right back there. They call it though the Pelita Corrales drop move of 20 yards. But here Mercado. on the other side, the Panek right. Mercado still on fighting for, for the Petrogas Angels. A great set pa rin, no? from Chi Sayet. And kita natin late si Panaga to cover that angle. Mercado gets a point. And looking at the back row, that also confused Yonko, who was prepared to get cross hits. Kasi butas yung Block. Because you're defensive formation. 
um, your floor defense is all, always based on the blockers. So you're right, talaga nagkakagulo pag late yung top. Okay, ito, pakinggan natin yung timeout ni Coach Jasper Jimenez. Mas maganda kung, kung nandito yung spiker, tapatan mo na hindi yung dito kagaling. Kailangan, nandiyan, tapatan mo na siya. Kasi ang, 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 ang set naman is pagano naman talaga yan, eh, pagkagaling din sa 4. So mas maganda, tapatan mo na siya para ang, ang ano nun is cross siya. Ang, ang habol mo is papasok. Ha? Okay? So, kumpiyansa tayo, kumpiyansa tayo, kumpiyansa tayo. Kumpiyansa tayo. Coach Jasper Jimenez clarifying and fixing the defensive pattern because we've noticed parang may lapses na nga dito sa panic ng ating Bokaisan Air Force Lady Warriors. Yeah, and you know, they always practice eh. So sometimes the coaches has to remind them na, okay, we've been practicing this formation with the, you know, this happens and the spider here and whatnot. They just have to know how to adjust. And they have to execute it properly. Yeah. Just like that last play, well executed by kay Myla Pablo. Parang back na patong. Yeah. Galing, no? It really confused the defense of the Angels. I got nobody home. You would be on the side of the Angels. Parang, saan pa puta si Myla? Pes ba? O, likod. <laughs> Pablo again. Saed goes to Sabete. She's denied there by Yonko and Pax. Three ball ang binigay niya atin, Chi. Semana chooses Yonko, Yonko with that head back. Yes, oh, you know, that was a great set for Wendy and Semana. It totally confused the blockers. Look at that. Whoop, nobody. My even. Oh, nobody went up yeah. to challenge Yonko. Great set. And that's very specific and that's something that you're really going to do. But on the other side, I was about to say, Chisa, I think it's one of the only ones that the ball is going to be hit. So, let's see how it's going to be Chisa. Shen Cruz puts it up for Sabete. Soft touch. Semana is going to go to Yonko. On the tip. Sabete is going to answer. Check there. Sabete on the second ball. Pablo mula sa kabilang oh, panic. Good thing. Sabete sa subok muli. Nice save there from Myla. Passes from the back row. She saw it. Chooses Balwalwa from the middle, but Balwalwa she is back, the night there. Well done, Panaka. But <laughs> 21 to 20. Well, Panaka is pretty vivid there. Let's look back at that play. But this is the Banco save of the play coming from, or save of the day rather, galing kay Myla Pablo. Nabalikan natin yun yung last point. Ayun naman pala. Hindi talaga umaaman yung mga tao. Sumabit yung kanyang dali, yung pababa siya. So, net violation ang itatawag. But to all fairness to Banco, from our angle, it wasn't also clear because the events were so fast. Yeah. That's true. I mean, I think that was the longest rally here in this match. It's sad to end in, a, in, in that error. way. But here, oh, Coach Jasper is forced to call another timeout. Pakinggan natin ito. Pero tignan mo, kung nakatapat ka nga, pag pumunta dito, eh, I'll oh, adjust ka para yung hahabol is maka, maka, makadikit sa'yo. Para maka, sabi ko sa inyo, mas maganda makahipo man lang tayo. Eh. Okay, walang hipo. Okay. Hindi pwedeng, for kita andyan, kailangan mag-adjust ka rin, okay? Kailangan natin isang, isang maganda result, okay? Kapiyansa ha, kapit ha, kapit ha. Okay, go, 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 go! Balikan lang natin kanina yung ating Fudgy O, Fudgy Bar O Bar sa sarap moment of the game. Yung celebration nga naman, ni Kai Nebomoseno Balwalwa at hindi to the group hug. Yeah. What a heartwarming moment on the side of our Angels, but nothing to worry about on their side of the court. They're up by two points. Pero titingnan natin kung magigising na ba yung ating Air Force Lady Warriors after that timeout. Kaliyon puts it up for Balwalwa. Semana was there at the back row. Sasagot dito, Pablo, down the line! At may check ball! Putos para sa kapay. Well, crucial moment, you have to go to your ace gunner and Pablo delivers for the Lady Warriors. Look at that! What an asshole! He was! Oh! 
what else can you expect from Amaya Pablo? <laughs> Saet goes to Balwalwa. Balwalwa Through the blockers. The block. She's been playing so well today. Talk about Balwalwa. So, I got to talk to Balwalwa. I got my Queen Bulldog down in the middle. The original Queen Bulldog, Kai Kipoposeta, is true. here. But Coach Jerry now inserts Mendes and Janelle Cheng. So, full front line again. Similar to the stat, Gino Percent, walang nagbago. Janelle Cheng there for the serve. Cases down the line, picked up by Paneng. Pinangat ni Shen dito para kay Mian Mendes. Pokai calling for a touch ball, a catch ball ra rather. Settle, settle, settle. Illegal attack yung setter niya, illegal attack. Hindi, illegal attack. Nat lang lang abab din it yung ball, nat sa taas. So, balikan natin yun. May illegal attack daw. Oh, there is a... May skip, may... Yeah, there is. Nakaubangat yung hand niya over the net. Over the net. Maliban, that's what's crucial there. Yung pag-angat ng kamay over the net. With the completion of that attack. So yeah. here on this last play naman. There's a ball touch on the Lady Warriors. And that's it. And set point advantage. A net is called again. A net violation rather is called against Cases there. Yung pagbaba niya. Uh, okay. That was clear. So habit yung kanyang ta. <laughs> Samana now chooses Yonko, Yonko who gets the point block. back. So let's see if they will be able to get a deuce oh. here. Yun ang malinis na malinis, sigurado tayo doon. Ia <laughs> Yonko, sir. Set point pa rin for the Angels. They go to Mercado. Net touch. Ooh, a Mercado. net touch naman sa panig ng ating Pentagas Angels. Ang magtatabla sa ating match at 24. <laughs> And what a time, no, for, for the score to equalize at 24 apiece. Very crucial moments here. But for you to also do crucial errors. Period. You know, gusto natin puntos off the block. Galing kay Mea and Mendez. Yeah, but what a set by, by Cheng. Yeah, because Mendez just actually came in. Pero yun yung sinasabi natin, yung tiwala ng center sa isang player because of practice, and you know? I know you can do this at this time, and it's a proof that they've been gelling as a team. Yeah, that's true. Semana goes to Palomata, who scores off the block. May pagtilid sa side ng ating Angels, kasi if you'd notice, the serve, the reception was kind of problematic, pero ginawa na lang ng para atin. Katagig putos pa yun para sa ating Pokai's with Air Force Lady Warriors. Cases on the service line. Soft serve there. Palomata on the regalo. And that gives set point advantage to our Lady Warriors, which forces Coach Jerry to call a timeout. Let's listen in. Relax, Pia, say on. Isang clear instruction lang yun na yun ko doon. Relax, P. Sayo. Yeah. Mukhang kay Pablo yun, ha? Well, yeah, I mean, again, if it's crucial moment, you want to go to your side. That's what I'm going to do now. Lady Warren. Paneng rather. Pablo sa kabila. Paneng dito sa kabila. So let's see which captain will be up to the challenge as they go up to Paneng. So Jerry said, relax sa'yo. At sa kanya na. Putos na agad. And we are tied again at 26. Babalik. Si Nabalwalwa at si Saif. One full rotation already. Coach Jerry. It's going to be interesting. You have De Leon, Balualua, and Mercado against Pablo and Del Palomata. Semana chooses Pablo. Si Mercedes Tudon. 
Sight on the other side goes to Mercado, but a double contact is called against She Sight. Oh, that's huge, huh? Let's look at that again. The the release It's problematic on that part. Palomata there on the serve. Side goes back to Panik. On the other side, Balwalwa naman. Yonko was there. Which is Pablo. That's too wide. Oh wow, what a time for that hitting error. That was set point for the Lady Warriors. And this is what Coach Jasper was saying about their game, their last game against the Lady Eagles, na yung first set daw, sayang na lang talaga at nakakapanghinayang yung nangyayay dun sa dulo ng yeah. first set na yun. Kasi yung mga errors din nila yung pumatay sa kanila. Ooh! That's an ace! <laughs> the <laughs> Lady Warriors were frozen there on their side of the court. <laughs> yeah, an ace serve there by Mercado. Mercado! <laughs> Scoring not just in, in the front line, pero kahit sa service line, kung putos itong si Panek, tingnan natin kung makakaisa pa siya. Pero Pablo says stop. Sasagot sa kabilang Panek. Sabete, down the line! Oh, <laughs> and that gives set. set number two to Angels. our Petrogas Angels. 29 to 27. to 27 lang naman. Let's look at that last play. Yeah, it was a smart hit by Sabete. Just Going through the smaller blocker in Semana, she goes down the line and she gets the second set for the Angels. He's going above the blocker there, was Jonas Sabete, and that brings the Angels to a two-set advantage. Tikingan natin ko ano mangyari. Wag po kayong kukurap. 